This is the area he shot her in. And okay. there's actually bullet holes in the little white fence that she built. 21-year-old Mikhail Johnson shows us his backyard where police say his stepmom was shot by an elderly neighbor. He took the butt of his gun after shooting my mom right over here. And uh, apparently out of frustration, he just smashed it. 70-year-old John Shadbar next door charged with attempted murder and a hate crime while Melissa Robertson was shot in the stomach. The mom of two always feared this day might come. It's disheartening that it takes something like this to finally be heard. In court today, Will County prosecutors said unregistered guns and ammo were taken from the suspect's house and we've learned that the family next door had documented years of aggressive behavior. <laughs> Like Shadbar firing guns in his yard, throwing fireworks over the fence, and relentless racial slurs. He called me the N-word, like straight to my face. A few days later, he came out with a, holding a gun in his underwear. Mikkel says they called police at least three times. His mom, who is white, and her two black sons felt threatened. And they would say, unfortunately, as wrong as it is and as hateful as it is, it's freedom of speech. The Will County Sheriff did not respond to questions about their history at the Lockport home. I don't want anyone else of color, people of color, feeling like this, like they don't deserve to be where they are just because they're black and they're in the wrong neighborhood, or so, or so to speak. But um, I just wish we could all be treated equally. Shadbar was denied release by the judge, the mom next door now facing surgeries and fighting to survive. In Lockport, Will County, Randy Gyllenhaal, NBC5 News. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.